If you hear my brother, I'm sorry. He's playing video games and he doesn't know, he doesn't have volume control, <laughs> you know. Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. If you guys are new here, I am Joanna. If you're not new here, welcome back. This video is sort of made on a whim. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Good, 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 good. So today I thought I would do a video where I plan my month out. So since the last, the first video that I posted for the All Too Real Diaries, go check that out. As you guys know, I said in the video that I have been struggling with like myself and like how I feel about myself and everything like that and like where I am in my life and that hasn't gone away <laughs> this isn't like I feel better in like two weeks because I'm not but I did start doing things to help me feel better if that makes sense so I don't know how to explain it though that's why it's confusing here's the thing with me is that I get very confused very easily <laughs> like I don't know why but I forget things so quickly all of a sudden like what I'm doing or what I was saying I'll, I forget it really quickly so I don't know what I was talking about or where I was going with anything and that's why the past couple videos I have written out what I wanted to say and what I wanted to do in the video but for this one this is kind of on a whim so there's nothing planned <laughs> because technically that, that's what the video is, is me planning. But what I was trying to say is, is that I have decided to start doing things that is going to better how I'm feeling about myself and how I'm feeling just like physically and mentally in general. I'll explain what they are in a second. But I think part of the issue that I have that is making me sort of like constantly spiral and feel like out of control I guess just feel like not good like how I was in that video like I think part of the reason that I feel that way is because I have no structure even though I do have a job where I do have I, I do have a routine because I'm a person of habit and if I don't have a routine I don't know what to do with myself but I feel like I need a bit more structure so I thought it would be a good idea to plan out my month because I do have things I want to get done this month and like going forward in general but yeah and I did sort of have something like this like before at the beginning of the year I do have let me get this is my bullet journal I was gonna make a video of me doing this but when I tried to make it last year I was very stressed <laughs> and my desk setup was very different from when I filmed it the first time last year so I didn't want to go through and have to deal with that but this is my bullet journal and this year I decided that I was going to make goals for myself. Like for the year and each month, I'd have a different goal, if that makes sense. So this page right here, put the light down for you to kind of see. But on this page right here, I have my goals and they're in different sections for career, finances, health, and personal. Now I'm reading it to see if like, um, if I've been taking any steps to get to any of these goals by the end of the year. There are a couple that I'm sort of making my way to. I'll show you Marches or Aprils of like, but the tracking that I do, because I wanted to, at the end of last year, I decided that I listened to the book Atomic Habits because everybody raves about it. And to be honest, the book didn't tell me anything that like you wouldn't already know, I feel. <laughs> Like, it's a good book. Like, you should still, like, listen to it or, like, read it. I think it's very helpful. But in the book, it says to do, like, habit tracking. And, you know, when you see people do their bullet journals and stuff, they do have, like, habit trackers. I keep, like, fixing my posture to, like, sit up because in this chair, I'm, like, down here. <laughs> and I'm, like, I need to stay in frame. Anyways, but I only have seven right here. Hold on. Look at the mood tracker for April. Isn't it so cute? Isn't it so cute? Oh, my God. It's 
It's a little like paint palette. I love it. Anyways, I have seven habit tracker things that I have that I wanted to do more of this year. They're workout, drink more water, clean more often, read, journal, film and edit. Now, for the first three months, I only filled out four of these boxes, which was, I mean, technically like consistently like two of the boxes, which was journaling and reading and maybe cleaning, but even then cleaning I did only like once a week or so. But this was the most that they've been filled out. But what I'm saying is I have a way of like tracking these things to see if I am doing them. But I feel like if I plan more what I want to get done, maybe it'll be easier for me to do it. I don't know. Anywho, we're gonna plan my month. I thought this is just like a generic planner that I think I got from Walmart like last year. Yeah, I got it last October and I didn't use it at all. I don't know what I was using this for to be honest with you. Like, yeah, I remember what I got this for. It was for exactly what I'm trying to do now, <laughs> which is to just do things and get it done for myself and what I wanted to get done. Cause I was trying to like notes and stuff done for video ideas that I had. I really tried, I really tried. I made no real progress though. So anyways, we're gonna skip ahead to May. Before we get started, there are some things that I wanted to tell you that I started that I'm very proud of myself for and wanted to tell you. And that's also part of the reason why I wanna plan things out more because I have no structure, like I said. But I started doing, I don't know if you guys have heard of this, but Google has these certificate programs where if you look up Google career certificates, there are five different courses for five different jobs that you can take and you like take a course it's basically like a class or something and at the end of it it'll give you a certificate and then it'll help you find better jobs within whatever field that you took the course in and i was looking it up and one of them was a data analyst or data analysis whatever i've been looking at those types of jobs to get into this whole time but i didn't know what it was and i was scared i'd be bad at it so i decided that i was going to take that course even though it costs money every month and I'm kind of sad about that but I decided I was gonna take the course and I started it last week and it's actually pretty interesting I actually kind of like it and the website that you're taking the courses on because you're paying the money like you can look at other courses that they have and I thought I'd look at other stuff see what else they offer and what I could do also my windows open if there's any outside sounds okay but i started that but i also decided to start this thing called the 75 soft challenge which is like the easier version of it's called the 75 heart challenge if you don't know what it is just type it in on tiktok there's like a million videos of it that's how i found it was on tiktok but basically there's only like five rules and i don't know if it's like for exercising or weight loss or like the lifestyle change whatever i honestly don't know but the soft version is I wrote it over here to eat well do one 45 minute exercise or workout every day you can have one active rest day but i decided that i'm not gonna do that i'm just gonna go the whole 75 because i feel like if i take a day off i'm gonna be like well i guess i'm not and i'm not gonna do it anymore and i don't want to risk that <laughs> i don't know specifically how much water they said to drink but i know it's two of these water bottles so i have to drink two of that water bottle a day i also got that at ross for pretty cheap it's a really nice water bottle so if you want one like that read 10 pages of any book at every day which will be very helpful in a moment when we're planning i'll explain why and then i added one which was to do my hip stretches every night because i'm getting sick and tired of paying for the physical therapy every two weeks i've decided to go every two weeks now so i'm not paying 160 dollars a month on it i'm only paying 80 but anyways with all those things being said and being added in i also want to plan videos and stuff too because i want i do want to post more and i think i've been doing a pretty good job considering i've decided to make this on a whim <laughs> really moving up in the world right now. <laughs> Things we're gonna plan. We're gonna plan out the month. I'm gonna try and plan out an overview because I don't wanna stress myself out. Weeks change all the time. You know, your time changes every week, but I wanted to plan some stuff out for the month so that I know when I can do certain things, what days I have free to do whatever I need to and stuff like that. So what we're taking into account here for this planning is the data analyst course that I I'm taking working obviously because if I don't 
what the videos I want to make, any appointments that I have. And I also have to take into account that the first couple weeks of this month, my mom is going on vacation. So she won't be home for the first couple weeks because she's going out of the country. So have fun, mom. Well, technically this would be up when she's gone. So I hope you're having fun. But yeah, so let's plan. I bought a bunch of colored pens yesterday. They're just generic big pens, but like, look, at, there's so many colors. This one, I was freaking out. Each of these have like a double. This one did not have a double. And when I was like writing it out to see what the colors look like, this one was not writing. And I was like freaking the fuck out. I was like, no, this, this only has one. What are we gonna do? But it's fine. And then I have some markers for what? I don't know yet. I have my planner. I have some entertainment here. And I have you guys so I probably won't talk too much while I'm doing it I'll probably just like film me figuring it out and then I'll come back and explain what I did so enjoy I wanted to come back on really quick because I went to stop recording it and I don't know why because it literally says recording on the thing and I am not looking at this fucking camera lens like I'm supposed to I'm looking at the viewfinder above it and I know it's recording but when I went to go click it I was like oh my god what if I filmed all that but I didn't even film I was about to have a break breakdown even though this video wasn't even planned maybe that's why not the point anyways enjoy <laughs> It's not like, it's a thicker pen. Okay, like it's 1.6 and I'm not used to it and it's so weird and I don't know if I like it, but like it was, it was cheap. So I was like, you know, you get what you pay for. No, I'm just kidding, no, but I thought they were gonna be like these ones. Like they're very different. Oh my God, you're not gonna see it. Like this one's pointy and this one's rounded. I don't like the rounded one. I thought it was gonna be pointy. It's not. Back to me planning. <laughs>
we're back. You saw me plan. There, there wasn't a lot. <laughs> as soon as I was writing it out, I was like, wow, you really don't have much to write, but it's okay. I think what I have is pretty good, so. But I guess I should explain something. So the, I mean, I don't have to, but I want to explain something. So the data analysis course, they said it takes six months to finish. I don't like that idea. So I'm going to really try and like knock it out, if you know what I mean. Just like be like on top of it. When you see this week, it won't seem like I did do that, but oh, that's another thing. So I just put on the month one, I marked what days I worked and what days I, do I don't work. And then I just put like overviews of things that like I know I have to do or I know that's going to happen. And then I went to like specific days and what I hope to get done. Now, some of these things aren't as specific or anything like that because I don't know what's gonna happen to change that if that makes sense. I'll explain when I get to it. I'm also not gonna show you like exactly what the page is. I'll hold it up but and I'll read it to you but I don't want to like figure out how to shoot the page so you can actually read it anyways. So let's look at the overview of the month. I swear if you can't see it I will be kind of upset. Now I don't know if you can see around the numbers are above and it's a different color. Red are the days that I'm working which is like like everything on this side Sunday through Wednesday and then my weekends are Thursday Friday Saturday technically you know it is off and then I made a little key what the colors means of the pen obvi and then I put in some stuff like on Thursday I have to take my mom to the airport and then the next Thursday I have physical therapy and then two weeks after that I'll have physical therapy too down here these ones they're just some video ideas I don't know if I'll do them or what day they'll be on that's why they're on stage so yeah and then these ones i try attempt don't don't be rude okay i try to post on sundays so i put the videos on sundays that i'm posting it i only know of two right now that will be up the one that's up tomorrow and this one that's why these ones are on sticky notes because i don't even know if i'll be able to do them then we go to the start of the week we have today which is saturday only thing that i'm planned out is to finish editing the video for tomorrow and then read 10 pages of my book that might at least 10 that's the only thing but i'm reading perks being well far right now which i know the last video i said i was reading something else i stopped to read this <laughs> i don't know i think because it was so big it was very daunting but that's not the reason why i chose a small book anyways but because it's so small i don't know like how much i'll like get through of it if you've read this book you know it's kind of like a quick read because he's just writing letters in it it's not like actual writing and then tomorrow the only thing that I have on here because I work tomorrow is to post the video and then my goal is to get halfway through the second part of this tomorrow which I don't think will be too bad the reading part I do take my books to work and when I'm just waiting around for rooms to leave I read my book so the reading part it doesn't take too much also I I'm not sure if I said this but I only planned a week because I wanted to see how this week went and if even I was able to get the stuff that I planned done. If I had a proper light, this probably wouldn't be an issue. I just want you to see like how much there is. So that is the overview of my next week. So I'll explain. Same thing for Monday. I just have reading and editing this video, which I don't think this one will take very long. I don't, so I just put it on two days. Even then that was me being generous. So for Monday, Tuesday, I just have reading and editing this video. But then Wednesday, because I don't work Thursday, I plan to do a pretty, not a pretty big, but like a good chunk of the data course that I'm taking. Also, since my mom, she's leaving on Thursday. So Wednesday, I plan to like make a menu of what we're gonna eat for the week because we gotta figure that out. And then Thursday, I didn't have very much of like productive stuff because I do have stuff to do that day. Not too much, but I am have to take my mom to the airport in the afternoon and I plan to hang out with one of my friends in the morning or like noonish. The only thing I have on there that's like productive is reading because I know I'll be able to read. <laughs> From Thursday on, I do, I put that I have to make dinner and figure dinner out and I want to get that done at five-ish because usually we eat really late because my mom makes the dinner and she comes home at like six usually like during the weeks. And then right here at the 
bottom like right here in the little bottom margins i put like some of the basic stuff for the 75 soft challenge that i want to make sure that i do which is the workout the drinking the water and the hip stretches just to have it on there so i can still see and be like oh gotta do that you know then friday is like productive day ish so i'll do reading i'll try and clean the house and then i'll do another big chunk of the data analysis course whatever and then saturday i'll just edit the next video that i make which will probably film either friday or saturday because i usually just film on saturdays because no one's home so saturday either i'll film or edit a video and then i have make make dinner and that's about it so and then again for sunday is just post the video read 10 pages of whatever i also didn't fill in after tuesday the book title because since small and i'm reading every day i don't know if i'll be if i'll i'll probably finish it especially since today i don't really plan on doing anything else except finish the little bit of editing that i need to do for tomorrow's video and that's not gonna take me very long so i'll probably just like do more reading today than anything and yeah i feel good i i like that i planned it out especially since my mom is leaving this week and so i'll be a little in chaos because she won't be here to help with me <laughs> for about for two weeks i am happy with this in the next video i'll update you guys if it's actually like helped me throughout the week or if it worked or if i stuck to it because sometimes i start this stuff and then i don't stick to it but i've really been wanting to do this so i don't think that i won't stick to it but yeah so that was just this video it was just a little quick thing that i wanted to do if you do like things that are like a plan with me or anything like like that or if you want more journaling type videos or like stuff like that just let me know because you know that's what i was originally gonna do on this channel when i started it but i changed it up a little bit so there's that <laughs> hope you enjoyed hope you probably planned with me how your week gonna go how your month is going so i know some people do these videos and they put all their stuff on like the calendar on their phone or like their planner on their ipad or something like that or on notion but I prefer good old handwriting that's just me but also then I probably might put this somewhere else too but no I do like to handwrite it out even though you couldn't see it and I'm very sorry you couldn't see it but yeah I hope you guys are doing well and I hope you have a good first week of May or you had you know, yeah I hope you had a good first week of May it was a very chill video I didn't I didn't really do much in it but if you enjoyed it please like it please subscribe I try and post videos on Sunday slash monday so if you want to see more of me there's that all my stuff is in the description if you want to follow me on anything i will try and start posting on other social medias but sometimes i get nervous anywho that's it that's the video bye